Hi everybody, it's me again, Bill here, still here. I was, thought I was going to wind these things up, but I thought I'd just keep the story running until the very end. Um, well, I hope not the very end, but you know what I mean. Uh, is uh, I, I've just got back from the hospital. I had the dermatology uh, skin uh, check, the full skin check just now, which was the sort of part of the pathway they give you so you, you once your initial melanoma is uh, diagnosed at the moment the way the pathway goes is they give you a six month full skin check and then they give you another one at 12 months and I, I guess if everything's okay then they sign you off but maybe if things aren't maybe they keep it going a bit longer I don't know I haven't got that far yet but so I went for my six month check just now and uh, saw Alem the clinical nurse specialist at the Beckenham Beacons uh, hospital uh, and checked me all over she's happy everything's fine all the wounds that I had have healed nicely no issues there yeah I've got some decent scars there I look like I've been used for bayonet practice but uh, I don't mind that I'm not going to be walking down any catwalks soon so it doesn't bother me and you know I'm, I'm always covered up now anyway I'm not going to go out and sun sunbathe or anything like that on the beach so it doesn't matter that I've got all these scars all that worries me is that I haven't got any uh, any moles that could turn cancerous anyway she's checked me all over and there's two more that she's said look what do you want to do I, I'm not worried about them she said but if you want I could take these out because you know as a precautionary measure but I suspect that they're just going to come back the same as the other ones so I've said yeah do it yeah I don't mind so there's two more on the back uh, that's going to be excised and that's going to be done not in any quick time she said the time wait at the moment is something like four or five months so I'm not worried about it she's not worried about it but it's it's a precaution so we're going to take those out and she also said look when you come back then there are a few others so we'll have a look at those and see how things are maybe we'll, we'll have those out as well but for now just two more and I'm waiting for that appointment and I will update you when I get that appointment to let you know everything was fine uh, so that's it, a quick, short and sweet today. Uh, take care, everyone. I hope you're... Well, we finished the summer here, although the sun's shining outside in the UK. Yeah, we're now moving into winter time, I think, so don't think there's much chance of getting uh, any more sun damage now. Yeah, anyway, even if I was uh, somebody like lounging about in the sunshine. So I hope you're keeping yourself out of the sun and using the Factor 50, remember, and uh, making sure you wear a hat particularly. Uh, okay, take care, everyone. Bye-bye.